So, welcome back to the channel, people. And we're back on the hunt for some more gold. But today, all I've got with me is minimal equipment. And what we're going to be doing is a bit of crevicing with the basics to see if we can still find some gold. So, let's get down the river and get amongst it. Now, according to legend, the gold in these rivers is protected by a mythical beast. Now, this mythical beast is a dragon. A dragon! Whatever next day. Huh? That looks like a big bird. Hang got a minute. Fly me now! What happened then? The legends must be true. Has he gone? Oh well, let's get back on the gold panning. Geology around here is amazing. It's just full of quartz. And I reckon if you crush that down, you might even get a few specks out of that too. So to go gold panning in the UK, you don't need expensive sluices, shovels, pumps, you just need the basics. So let me just show you what I've got in my bag. I've got a pan, a little snuffer bottle, another couple of pans, bigger ones though. We've got a few basic tools. We've got another snuffer, bigger one. We've got trusty spoon, screwdriver, little pry bar, and a little scraper. And that is all you need to find gold. So let's get in the river behind me and get amongst it, do some crevicing, and get some gold in the pan to show you. And that is what we call people bedrock heaven. Let's get amongst it and see if we can find any gold. Now I think these are gonna be my first two targets. And the reason why is the stones packed in there, look. So it tells me that they haven't been dug out in a while. There's a little nice big stone in there. So let's work them. Now we've dug most of it out, all I'm going to do is splash some water in the crevice, wash it all into this section here, and then I'll just pump it out with a little snuffer. That crevice is all cleaned out now. Let's get it panned out and see if we've got any gold in there. black sun in there and there's some nice pieces of gold as well Ooh, there's a nice little piece in there if you look there we've got a nice speck there nice speck there a few little specks all dotted around nice speck there and quite a bit of flower but what i want to do i want to snufferize it all up and then i'll clean it up properly and show you how much gold we get from all this crevicing at the end but that's not too bad for the first pan happy with that So 
So this looks like a nice juicy crevice. You've got moss growing over it. So this is my favourite type of prospecting. It's just finding the easy gold and the little nooks and crannies. And anyone can come out and do this with minimal equipment. Cleaned that crevice to an inch of his life. Let's see what's in the pan. So, at the second crevice, we've got a few more specks, some nice flakes there, and a load of flour. So, I think I've hit a nice spot here. So, I'm just going to carry on digging these crevices and let's see how much gold we can get. So, I've just cleaned out another crevice and I've got some more gold in the pan. It just shows you that you don't need expensive equipment to find gold in the UK. So now I've worked all that area now and I've got quite a few specks out of it. But unfortunately I've run out of time. So let's clean up the gold I've got in this stuffer bottle and show you how much gold we've got for today. And as you can see, you can see the specks already. Let's just get that cleaned up. So that's today's show and I ain't done too bad there. There's lots of flour and some decent looking size specks. So for the small amount of dirt I moved, that is pretty good to be honest. Let me just zoom in and show you the best specks. So what a great day down the river again people. We managed to get some more gold using minimal equipment. We managed to avoid the dragon for the rest of the day and didn't get burnt alive, so that's a bonus. Um, but that's how easy it is to find gold with minimal equipment. So what are you waiting for? Get down the river, get your pans, get your spoons, and go and find some gold. So until next time, people, thanks for watching. One man and his pan. <laughs>